Hey guys, so here's this 52 inch Hobo Breeze Lakeside 2 ceiling fan. Yeah, I got another Lakeside 2. This one's in polished brass finish. The other one I had was in white. The white one, I had it on August and I restored it. And that one had a bad capacitor. And I had to replace it and it works great. And that fan had very thin blades and I had to bend them back. And they're back to shape and I would turn it to habitat and it was sold quick. It's a really good fan too. But now I have another one and some polished brass finish. Oh yeah, the other one is from 2007. And and it had diamond brackets, but this one's from 2004. It's from it's from April and June 2004. And it has the older style brackets. And it has wooden pole chains, but does not have a logo. The other one had a logo. And I had to get two new Hobo Breeze pole chains because it did not come with them. So yeah, about this fan. This fan also has a bad capacitor. And it only works on one speed. On all three speeds. It only works on low on all three speeds. And it has a bad capacitor. It's, it's very bad. It has a couple of cracks in it. And, and got melted. it got melted a little bit. Yeah. And it makes a humming noise. It makes a... The humming noise is a little bit loud. And I will replace it as a capacitor. And this is the new capacitor I put in. But here's a picture of the old capacitor that's currently on this fan. Yeah. This fan is dusty on the blades, as you can see. It's dusty. I will clean it. I haven't cleaned it because I wanted to test this fan with a bad capacitor. Canopy is not original. It's from another Hobo Breeze Lexi like 2 and Polish Brass. But this canopy got painted in um, brown. And that lakeside too does not have any blades or the light. It only had the canopy, downward, and just the motor. That's all, no screws. Yeah. That lakeside too, it's been there since when I first went to Habitat the first time when I recorded it. And I wanted to show y'all a picture of that fan. Here it is. Yeah. Mining bike is not original. It's brand new because it did not come with it. And it has polished brass screws. These are new screws. Um, I got the downward too, but I tried putting the downward on, but the ground wire on this fan will not come off. The screw is very stripped and it will not come off. So I flush mounted it instead. Yeah. This fan did not come with, it came with no downward, no canopy, no mounting bracket. It was missing, um, those are the three parts that were missing. It was also missing all blade screws and one switch housing screw. Yeah, that's, that's what it was missing. And the pole chain is not original as well because the old one was broken. It had, the whole switch was broken. It was coming into pieces. And I also have a picture of it. Here's that. Yeah, the blades, the blades are dusty. The shades are dusty too. I don't know if y'all can see. The top housing is dusty. But anyways, oh yeah, the reverse switch. I accidentally put it on the wrong way, and this is downdraft facing. But when I restore this fan, I will fix this sw switch to where, where it needs to be. But anyways, I'm about to demonstrate this fan. 
It only has it only has one speed, low only, and it has a bad capacitor. But anyways, here we go.